I wasn't really around, you know, when she had, I think, I believe she was playing in the Solon Cups. And, um, but after she had her she will baby, seems like she's making a huge comeback. She's been playing great last year. I think what a heck of a year Karina she had last year, given the fact that, you know, her baby, you know, is not very old, probably just a year old, I think, Lola. It's not very easy to be a mom on tour, but actually for me it worked out. Uh, we have the luck to be to have a daycare on tour, so it's a little bit easier. But um, gave me more confidence in my game because uh, I was able to uh, training less, but with more quality of my training because I want to spend more time with my my girl. She, when she's practicing now, she's so much more focused. She might not be out there practicing for as long, but the, the hours she puts in, she is much more quality because then she knows she needs to get her stuff down so, done so she can go home and uh, be a mom. So now we travel maybe with uh, one, maybe uh, 250 pound of luggage. So it's a lot of stuff. Uh, she has her own, her own long, uh, luggage uh, for the clothes, toys, diapers, things like that. Something amazing. Last year we bring her in Asia. So I was a little bit stressed about how I'm going to find diapers in Korea, Japan, country like that. So I had to pack 350 diapers. <laughs> she took Lola over to Asia and she's done some things that most of us as mothers haven't done. I mean, she really didn't want to be separated from her. And I think that speaks volumes for her. She does it with her husband caddying on the bag. That in itself is, is challenging. Uh, so she must be very patient. <laughs>